hey guys welcome back to my channel so today's video i will be showing you guys how to do these fairy garden moss nails that's been trending all over social media i wasn't going to make this a talk through but it was a lot going on while i was doing these nails so i'll be just popping in and out periodically to explain anything that i need to explain so yeah we're just gonna do a short press on set um i know a lot of you guys and my previous videos have commented about me doing short nails um so here you are finally doing some short nails uh so yeah so we're gonna be doing an acrylic um press-ons today so in the beginning what you saw was basically i had mixed um i showed you the three acrylics that i had mixed together basically because i wanted this like pinkish um sheer type of um base for the nails and i don't have an acrylic that looks like this so basically i mixed a valentino carnation with the valentino i think 162 um pink shade and then i mixed it with some valentino uh, crystal clear acrylic powder and that gave me this pretty sheer pink shade right here so yeah so i'm just gonna let you guys enjoy the video and i'll be back um to explain anything that i need to explain
okay so here um i basically did all my frenchies um i recorded myself doing the frenchies but i deleted the clip because i didn't want to put it in the video so i ended up drilling off all of the frenchies off camera because i just didn't like how it came out um typically when i do frenchies or french um tips i like to do them on longer nails so whenever i do them on short nails it just always looks so like big and bulky for some reason so so the white frenchie that i showed in the beginning of the clip um that one came out the prettiest so basically i had drilled off all the other frenchies and i kept that one um white french tip that you guys just saw and then i kept that one green one that you see right there so basically i'm starting all the other nails all over again so they could look similar to the two frenchies that i showed in the beginning of the clip um so yeah So I inserted a screenshot of the moss um, that people usually use whenever they do these nails. Um, but I unfortunately don't have any moss. But I'm like, you know what? I have all of these uh, dried flowers that I don't use at all. Um, I rarely ever did any type of nail design that consists of dried flowers so i really don't know why i have bought all of these a long time ago but um so yeah i just had all of these just sitting there collecting dust and i'm like you know what since i don't have any moss and i really want to do these nails i'm gonna just use every single green dry flower that i have in these little boxes <laughs> so right now i'm just taking out all of the green flowers and we will be using that to make our moss garden nails and some of the nails that you see me taking out that's not green um i was planning on using those just for like a type of like floral decoration but i ended up not really using any of them i think i only used probably like one or two of the flowers um i think i used the blue one and then some of the pink ones but yeah um i feel like if i would have added all of those extra flowers that i took out it would have looked very like very garden garden-esque but um maybe next time um, i doubt i'll do these nails again but if i do then next time i'll use the other flowers
So right now I'm just taking my tweezers um, and my fingers to just crumble up all of the um, flowers and leaves since a lot of the flowers are connected to like those little stems. Um, I don't want any of the stems on my nails so I'm just breaking apart. Um, they were very easy to they were very easy to break apart. Um, basically like as soon as you touch them they would like fall apart. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just crumbling up everything.
so a lot of nail techs that i see when they do these nails they have like those cute little butterfly charms um i unfortunately don't have those either but i do have these butterfly stickers so i am gonna be using these to apply on all of the uh white french tips So yeah, these are the nails, you guys. I think they came out super pretty. Um, will I do these nails again? I I don't think so, but um, it wasn't really bad, but um, it was just very messy. That's what I will say. It's, it was very messy, but they still came out super pretty. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell if you are a new subscriber to be notified when I post a new video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.